YouTube. Morning. Monday morning. Take two. Oh, it starts out okay, then went crazy for a moment, but we're back. Grab your cup of joe. Let's go. Raining. 64 degrees. Hyper Day Weather Station. 68 degrees. 9.02 in the AM. I started this. I started this video at, at 8.30. Had a good weekend uh, with my brother and my sister-in-law, my boys. It's always a good time. They know they know just what to say to get old mom riled up. They kept her going just about all day long. Food was good. Weather was great. Take a moment. Be thankful for what we have and the reason why we're uh, celebrating this day. Black Rifle. Veteran owned. Waiting to see. Uh, Mom got a bug about getting her car detailed. Waiting to see if this detailer shows up in the rain. <clears throat> also this week this this still this still uh, amuses me that there's actually a company that will come around and wash your garbage cans mom's got our Garbage cans on the list for this week. I don't understand it anymore. Made my order there. I told y'all about ordering up from the old jungle website. Got some coffee and some and a filter for my shop back. I opted for the free shipping, which meant I had to wait because I was really in no hurry. Because I have, you know, coffee and what have you. Yeah, it was going to be delivered on today. Supposed to be delivered today. And yeah, Amazon's working today. But anyways, this was this this was shipped out of Michigan, Pontiac, Michigan. They shipped it early, so I got to you know it will be delivered on Sunday. Gave me a tracking number. So I punch in the tracking number into my package tracker. Just something I like to do. I mean, if I can get a tracking number, I, I will I'll track anything. I think it's cool. Anyways, the tracking number came up with the USPS. I'm like, well, they don't work Sundays. But I got up yesterday and I checked and it was it was at the it was at the mentor post office.
said delivery will be on Tuesday, which makes sense because, well, today is a holiday. Nope, it showed up yesterday about 8 o'clock. Then yesterday, I ordered some vitamins from the Jungle website. And they said it would be delivered today between 8 and 10 a.m. They've gotten very precise. Used to, used to be it's like the, your de, Southward delivery and will be delivered by 10 o'clock at night. So I got up and coming out this morning with with my my coffee at O Dark 30. 6.30 in the AMM. There it was, laying on the porch. That right there is the bottle of vitamins. That there is a waste of money. But really... Who am I to tell Amazon how to do their job? They seem to They seem to be doing pretty good. Considering they got way too many trucks on the road at the same time in the same neighborhood. But I guess they're coming out of different distribution centers which here in Cleveland, there's four that I know of. They got a big one down right down here in Euclid, about 15 miles away. Used to be a mall, a shopping mall that the economy killed. And Amazon bought the property and didn't repurpose the building, the mall. The mall was pretty huge. They tore it down and built a new building. They got like 150 docks in there. That's a lot of trucks coming and going. But like I said, who am I to tell them how to do their business? I never operated that many trucks in my life, so. A couple times in 41 years, we had two. One time was two and a half. That's a different that's a different story for a different day. But you know what they say when you start adding trucks to your fleet? You start adding headaches and pains in the um uh hind end. So <clears throat> well, I'm going to skedaddle. I'm going to sit here and wait. Well, if I'm going to sit here and wait, I can't skedaddle. <sighs> okay, I'm going to slack off and wait for this uh, detailer to show up and try to wash mom's car in the rain and then try to collect money for it. Ain't going to happen. Unless that sun pops out and the ground dries up, he ain't going to be washing no cars here. Well, he definitely ain't washing mine. I can do that myself.
I always told mom, I said, you got Rita driving you around. Have her run it through the car wash. What's so hard? Ah. <sighs> Life, life has gotten really complicated and people are inventing jobs or businesses that 10 years ago, you, you never, you, you never would have thought of. Mobile detailing. Now, I, back in the day, they were detailers, but you had to take your car to the sh to the detail shop and leave it for the day. Now they come and do it right in your driveway. Another one is this garbage can washing thing. Who would have thought, man, you know? You know what this country needs is a good garbage can washing service. Used to be if your garbage can stunk, you got the garden hose out, threw in some dishwashing detergent, cleaned them up. Now they get, they got a, they got guys that are driving around in a truck. Wash your garbage cans. Either, either we've all gotten really busier or Lazier. Yeah, I'm gonna go. Hope your uh, hope your day goes well. And like I said, take time to remember the price of freedom is written on the wall. I'll see y'all next time. Peace. Wake up! Psst. Wake up!